and my own novice role in this office has left in some disre disrepair the normal consultative processes of this college. And so I seek understanding of the many members of the faculty who are dedicated to the welfare of the college, those who agree with me and those who do not. And where I have failed them in the past few days, to be able to establish contact with them. I shall bend every effort to restore such contacts and normal procedures just as soon as I possibly can. To start pressure from my side upon the trustees and upon Dr. Dumkey to find some money for all this. this is, that is to say that I do not ignore the fact that not only money is needed for these expanded programs, but money is needed for our ordinary operations here. And, for, and after, uh, uh, if the problem of, the, of establishing some kind of peace on campus is to some degree solved by the events of today, I'm going to push right on to the demand for more money. How much more, how money, much, how much more money would you require? Listen, I've only been in this job a week, and I don't know how much money is required to run anything around here yet. I don't know how much this would cost to implement these things. I don't understand about money. I, someone's got to teach me yet. As I said, this is an educational process for me, and before another week is over, maybe I'll learn something about what kinds of money are Aren't you then about. taking the same position as the previous two presidents, Dr. Smith and Dr. Shemmerstein? Well, if you see a similarity, okay, but I don't know what they did. <laughs> they asked for more money from the trustees and didn't get it. Do you think you'll get it? Well, I don't know. I haven't asked them yet. Can we get it clear about <laughs> speaking today as representatives, if you prefer, responsible representatives of black communities in the Bay Area. We feel that we can speak with much more authority than Dr. Hayakawa or Governor Reagan on behalf of that silent and long-suffering majority of black people who seek freedom through education. We support the demands and the aims of the Black Student Union as represented by their 10 demands. It is our belief to me.
Uh, my personal opinion at this particular point is the fact that he should not have been appointed in the first place. He's being used as a pawn, you if, see. If he was appointed. If he was appointed, yeah. That's the first thing. The, s the second thing is I would seriously question the way in which the appointment occurred, if it in fact did take place. What do you suggest should be done at this time about Dr. Hayakawa? Well, I think the only thing that can be suggested at this time is the fact that uh, either he resign or withdraw at this particular time, and that the due process, the ways and the avenues set up by the college itself, the university itself, should then, in fact, be enforced on how you select a president. Will the black community incur pressure to remove him from office? Uh, let me say that we are in the process of determining that kind of position.